Hi, this is Pooja from Alt News. Recently, Z News' Sudhir Chaudhary in his daily show DNA had alleged that the newly elected TMC MP from West Bengal, Ms. Mahua Moitra, had plagiarized her parliament speech. It's the same speech where Ms. Moitra had pointed out seven signs of fascism that she believed are rising in present India. Terming her speech hateful, Sudhir Chaudhary claimed that Moitra stole words from a 2017 American article, saying that Mahua Moitra ki research humse aage nahi ho sakti kyunki DNA mein research ko sabse zyada zor diya jata hai. Here's what Sudhir Chaudhary alleged. Research mein wo humse upar nahi ho sakti kyunki aap jante hain DNA mein research par sabse zyada zor diya ja sakta hai, diya jata hai aur jab aaj humne is par research kiya to hamara research Mahua Mitra ke research par भारी पड़ गया और उनकी पोल खुल गई ये जो भाषण है ये असल में किसी और का चुराया हुआ आइडिया है जिसकी हमारे देश के लोगों ने बड़ी तारीफ कर दी महुआ मित्रा ने जिन मुद्दों को लेकर भाषण दिया उसके विचार उन्होंने अमेरिका की एक वेबसाइट से चुराए थे इस वेबसाइट ने 31 जनवरी 2017 को अमेरिका के राष्ट्रपति डोनाल्ड ट्रंप के बारे में एक लेख लिखा था टीएमसी की सांसद महुआ मित्रा ने उसी लेख के विचारों को अपना बताकर संसद में अपने भाषण में पेश कर दिया सो वॉट एग्जैक्टली वॉज दिस आर्टिकल दैट चौधरी स्पोक ऑफ एक्चुअली एन अमेरिकन ऑथर नेम्ड मार्टिन लॉकमिन डिड राइट एन आर्टिकल इन 2017 व्हिच इज सिमिलर टू महुआ मोइत्रा स्पीच वाई लॉकमिन लिस्टेड ट्वेल्व अर्ली वार्निंग साइंस ऑफ फैशिज्म इन ट्रम्प अमेरिका Mahua Moitra pointed out seven signs that she believed were relevant in the Indian context. But Mahua Moitra did not steal from Longman's work. Longman and Moitra were both inspired by a poster that was available in the American Holocaust Museum. The poster listed 14 early warning signs of fascism. Like Longman had credited this poster in his article, Mahua Moitra had also revealed her source during her speech. In 2017, the United States Holocaust Memorial Museum put up a poster in its main lobby, and it contained a list of all the signs of early fascism. Each of the seven signs that I have pointed to you feature on that poster. So, Dean Chaudhary claimed that Moitra's speech was plagiarized from Longman's work, but Longman himself said on Twitter that she did not steal his work. But this did not stop social media influencers from targeting Moitra. Z News's false report was broadcast everywhere, on TV, on YouTube, on Twitter, and on Facebook, where it alone received 9 lakh views. The subtle tinge of sexism where Z News called her speech shrill also did not go unnoticed. The repercussions of the false report was that many social media users believed Sudhir Chaudhary's words to be true.